welcome back. One of my favorite things that I love doing in this yard, which we, we bought this house about three years ago. Um, so I don't know what all was growing in here before. It's been an adventure to find the different things that are growing. But one of my favorite things to do is go around the yard and find surprises. Things I didn't know that were growing, that I love, some beautiful flowers, some different native plants. And let me show you what I found. Look at here, y'all. I didn't know this was here. This is one of those spider lilies. I believe it's red. Let me pan over here for some more. I marked these by bricks when I found them because I didn't want to accidentally mow them over with the lawnmower. And I found some over here too. Check that out. Isn't that awesome? So what I want to do, since I found these, I want to dig them up and I want to put them in our flower bed. This one here, you can see the little root, the little bulb here. Look at that. This one, it's not gonna take much to dig up. Let's see, Let's see what it looks like. That's pretty insane that it's so close to the top. This is where that tree was. Let's see if we can get a better angle here. This is where that tree was that we had cut down because it was uh, threatening to fall on the house. So, let's see. I don't know how deep these little roots go. I don't want to break it. Let me go get a trowel. Okay, so I have my trowel. Let's see if we can get this up, see what the roots look like. Okay, let's see. Okay, check that out. That's pretty cool. We're gonna get this plant and let's see if we can get some of the other ones dug up. Before I go and dig up the rest of them, let me show you where these are gonna go. This is how they look when they're a little bit bigger. I dug these up after we got that big tree cut down in August. So about around September or so, I dug these up and put these in the flower bed. So this is, you can see my back up here. This is this front part of the flower bed here for our vegetable garden. And I'm gonna put these on this side to make them symmetrical right around here in between these daylilies and this rose so let's see right around here this will be good okay so i'm really just gonna dig a small little hole here like that and I'm gonna get this little ball tucked in and that's it so let's go get the rest of them all right guys let's get to this spider lily see if we can get her dug up and moved over to our, our new uh, flower garden here This is some mulch from that tree. We ended up getting cut down. I don't know how deep this is. Oh, look, I see an earthworm. Did y'all see it? Look at that big earthworm. Check it out in there. Wow, this is a pretty big bulb. Let's see if I can get a little bit deeper. Right, check out the worm. All right. Oh, this one's still caught right here. This one goes deep. Okay, here we go. Check that out. Let's see if we can get the other one dug up. Here's the third one. Let's get this one dug up. this mulch move out the way. All of this mulch is from that tree we had cut down. Wow. Okay. I 
think we got it. How about that? Looks like it's growing a little, another little side shoot right there. Okay, well let's grab this one and the other one and go get them in the flower garden. Okay guys, this is where we put the other one. Let's see. I think we'll just do a little trio here. Do one here. Put this nice big bulb. This one, we'll just stick that one right down in there. These are very forgiving. Cover you up. And let's do one right here. Okay, the fun thing about these guys is that the flower stalks co come up in January where we live and the leaves come out later. So there we have it. One more project down. Thanks for joining me today.